up you guys it's your girl sassy princess v i am back once again with another let's talk video i am back on mondays i'm trying to get it together we still have freaking problems with the power but you know what sass got y'all with the let's talk videos we gonna get into it without further ado let's get into this video i want to discuss should mental health be an excuse for criminal behavior so you know these last couple of years in this first of all this year period there has been a lot of for the last couple of years there's been a lot of cases going on so i've been hearing about you know criminals doing you know going up into nightclubs shooting them nightclubs i heard about a concert concerts um being you know shot at i heard about you know bus stabbings i have heard about a lot of criminal behavior so due to that you know there's a lot of people been saying oh well these criminals and these you know patients have had mental illness so my question to you guys is should mental health be an excuse for criminal behavior and i feel like that mental health should not be an excuse because at the end of the day i feel like i don't know if some people feel like this but you know what you're doing i don't care what the situation is i don't care what are you doing you know you should know wrong is wrong and um it's like it's like common sense and I know I feel like some people try to have that as an excuse and I feel like it shouldn't be an excuse because you know mental health is taken very seriously people all across the country have mental health issues and so I don't understand why every time there's a crime going on or every time something happens people say oh this person had mental illness I don't care what the situation is you knew exactly what you're doing you thought about this in your head and you acted on it I don't I don't feel like people should make an excuse for mental health because at the end of the day we all have you know our one mind we all have you know thoughts and I feel like mental health can cr trigger those thoughts but at the end of the day you still know what you were doing so I don't understand why people say, oh, well, mental health could be the issue of these crimes. Like, no. No, there should be no excuse to go out and commit act of violence. I don't believe that bullshit. I just, I, I don't, I don't believe it. I don't know what you guys think. Um, but just let me know in the comments section down below. You know, I just felt like that was just odd to me that we get that a lot. Every time a crime happens, you know, people always say the line that they use was, you know, this man or these facilities, these mental health facilities have been closed down and these patients have now had nowhere to go. I don't care what the situation is. You knew what you were doing. You knew exactly that if I commit this crime, it's going to be it's going to be talked about. And you know, people are going to consider it as me having mental health issues. But I don't think that's an excuse. So I'm opening up the question to you guys. I want to know what you guys think. Um, video, a big, big thumbs up. Make sure you guys smash the like button. Turn your notifications so you are not missing another video like this one. If you are new here, welcome, my loves. I am Sassy Princess V. Um, my voice is starting to cooperate, I guess. Um... Stay tuned for the next videos coming this week. I have some interesting ones. I'm trying to be back on regular schedule, but y'all, these videos, it's hard to post them out and put them out. Um, like I said, we've been having some stupid ass power problems. Um, hopefully, that can get resolved. Um, that's really much all I got to say. I love my sad family, and I will see y'all next time. Relations. Work so hard, forgot how to vacation. They